Hey guys, okay, in this section we'll see how to insert some data in our MySQL database table. Okay, on the previous topic, uh, we talked about creating a table and you can see here this is the code from the previous topic where we created a table in our MySQL database and this involved three steps that is we need to, uh, this one, MySQL connect function is used to connect to our uh, MySQL itself from PHP script and uh, second one that is MySQL select DB function this was used to select the database and then using MySQL query we created a table with two fields that is create table table name was test underscore data with uh, two data types name uh, with two fields name and age right now we are going to insert values uh, and here too we have just three steps step one and two are same that is we need to step one we need to connect to mysql and so we don't need to change this code and step two is to select the database so we don't need to change this one too step three uh, we have to use mysql query uh, to uh, insert value in our database instead of create table we have to use insert uh, insert into database table we just need to change this uh, what we call this one we just need to change this function I mean SQL query uh, to insert values in our database table and for that here in MySQL query we need to use insert into then we have to give our database name that is test underscore data right then we had two fields remember within braces uh, name comma age after that uh, values then we need to give the value within quotes single quotes that is say I'm going to insert the name called John J H O N okay then okay then after comma we are going to insert the age we just give the field for name that is John and for age I will give this one as 27 okay that's all we are closing this one I will show you again within mysql query function in PHP we are writing our SQL query that is insert into table name and the table name is test underscore data and it got two field name and age within braces then values and again within quotes uh, we need to give the values for name and age that's all and connection string after come at the end okay uh, you see we here this is uh, for handling exception right so I'm going a table created we all we are not going to create a table so we are going to insert a value so values not inserted into table successfully okay uh, if anything happens wrong or else uh, we'll have values inserted into table successfully okay uh, that will do for now so you can see here on the first step uh, we have we used mysql connect to connect our database uh, using uh, host as local host and I mean server and username as root with password 13456 this is for exception and on step 2 we selected the database test data using mysql select underscore db uh, this one is for exception and then on mysql query we inserted the value that is insert into table name that is test underscore data it got two fields name and age then value i am assigning as john with the age 27 that's all and also we got exception okay i'll save this file in the local server directory now by the name insert underscore table dot php okay we'll run this now you can see here connection successful value inserted into table successfully okay we'll check whether 
uh, we really got the table updated values are inserted using can check here in the quick link php my admin in a vam server okay that's taking lot of time here okay here test underscore data okay we need to uh, browse here and you can see here john and h two values are inserted here okay uh, that's it for now guys if you guys like my videos please subscribe i'll see you soon